with his stomach that shouldn't be possible or legal. As always, do not try this at home. Give it up for Penn and Teller and the professional regurgitators. Oh, wow. Whew. I want a fish. You want a fish? I want a fish. Well, we can, we can make him a fish, right? Oh, thanks. We're magic. We can make you a fish. You can oh, walk baby. here, I and out fish. of plain water, Teller will create a fish. Watch oh, this, Stevie. Brilliant. And there you have it, a fish right there. That ain't a fish. That's a fish. That's a fish. It's a, it's a round, a... flat fish. No... They live in the Arctic, I think. It's just, yeah, here we go. There's a lot more fish. They travel in schools. These are the very flat very no. round no. fish. You may have heard of them. They're called silverfish. And they just, they reproduce very, very quickly. Oh, see that? There's a bunch of them right there. No, I'm telling you, Steve, making them like crazy. You can pull them, you can pull them all off you here, Stevie. You can get all the fish you want. All the fish. fish. This way. <clears throat> there you go. Yeah, yeah, Stevie. So you can make the, uh, you can make, yeah, we make fish <laughs> like that. But if you, uh, those are kind of, uh, uh would you rather have goldfish than silverfish? You want goldfish instead of silverfish? Well, there's yeah. the silverfish. Get a little blow on them, and then see if we can turn them into uh, goldfish right there, Stevie. Watch this carefully. And there you have oh. the fish, Stevie. There are the fish right there for you. Those look good, don't they, Stevie? You like those? No, no. 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 Those are good. Those are really good. What the problem is, what's wrong? I can't swallow them. You can't swallow them? Look at them. Moby oh, oh. Dick and Free Willy. A little bit too big for you? Too big. Hey, okay. I got my own fish. Oh, you got your own fish? Yeah. Excuse me, sir. Would you mind bringing my fish? Oh, thank <laughs> you so much. Thank you. I appreciate it so much. Thank you're you. very welcome. Thank, thank, thank you. How about that? That Those more do you like? Fish. Is that more do you like? Those are my fish. fish. There you go. So, here's the deal. Okay. I got a little camera container. Okay. And I'm going to, first of all, swallow the lid. I would like to give you the container and the pen. You put a mark on this container. While you're doing that, I'm going to swallow a little Johnny. Goodbye. The lid, the small fish, you got the container. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna take the container, we're gonna fill the container up with water, just like that. I'm gonna put the container inside me with his name. I will find that little fish. I will put the fish in the container. I will then find the lid and I will lock it. When I bring it back, your name should be on there, and the fish should be inside. Shall we try? Oh, mamma mia. Move. Move. Here's my little fish. Is that your mark? Would you, would you take that lid off? Look in there. Can you can you pour that in there for me? Here, I have five thumbtacks. No. And here, yeah. I have a strong magnet. And I will swallow these five pins. No. Like this. No. Huh? Huh? <laughs> now, the magnet is going in. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. How many thumbtacks would you like me to put onto that magnet? We have five. Four. 
I will put four on. I will keep one over here. I will get it out. <laughs> Let's put four on for you. Okay. Now I have two on already. Okay, I got three on. I have one left inside me. You don't have to touch, but if you want to give them a little count. Oh, wow. We got one, two, three, and four. Oh, oh I better bring up the other one. And the last one. Yes. But I'm going back up here for a minute. I've got to show you something crazy. Okay. That was pretty crazy. Nick, can you come and help me? I'm not going to swallow you. Come here. Oh. Anyone at home watching this, please don't even attempt it. It's extremely dangerous. Nick, I need your help. <laughs> and you be careful as well. Yeah. I have here, ladies and gentlemen, a can of lighter gas. What I'm going to do is I'm going to swallow some lighter gas. I will hold it inside. I will then return the gas into a bubble. This gentleman will light that bubble, which hopefully will explode. So let's do it, Lottie. Nick, I have gas from here to here. Can you lift that lighter? Yes. Light it for me. Either one? Anyone you like. I want to show you nothing is coming out. You can light it. You sure? Yeah. Put it in my mouth. <laughs> nothing. I will bring you a little sample of what's in here. Light your lighter. is only a little bit. Now, we are going to make a bubble. And I will bring up the rest of that gas, which is in here, into the bubble, and we will have an explosion. All right, lad, can you light your lighter for me, please? You light that right now, keep it lit. Perfect, yep, light it. Bring your hand down a bit. The gas is coming up. That is full of lighter gas. Oh! <laughs> There's nobody, nobody in the world, okay, that can do what you can do. Nobody. And that to me, to me, that is a million dollar act. Mel B. I mean, you're just a guaranteed show stopper every single time. You're brilliant. <laughs> This next guy never fails to get a reaction, even though sometimes it's a physical one. And please do not try any of this ever at home, wherever you are, because it will not end well. Here's the professional regurgitator. And I'm not performing on stage. I'm not a professional regurgitator. I'm just me, Stephen. The first thing I do when I wake up in the morning is go straight for the diet of soda. I reckon probably I drink about six liters of soda each day. When I land in any city that I've never been into, it's straight to the grocery store. Well, I fill my bag up with chocolate and chips. I've never ate fruits, never ate vegetables. I couldn't really say I don't, I don't like the taste of them because I've never tried them. The only thing that I like, which is dairy, is butter. And I won't put it on bread, I won't put it on anything. I just love the taste of butter. I usually have about five or six baths a day. I've never lifted weight. If I'm going to be doing this type of motion, it will be to put chocolate in my mouth. I feel very privileged doing America's Good Talent and getting to this far in the semi-finals, you know, because there's so many people who wanted to come this far. I mean, in normal life's pretty quiet. I come alive when I'm on stage, Stevie Star, the regurgitator. That's when I come alive. Showtime. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. I'm overwhelmed to be back here in the semi-finals, and I hope I can show you something. Now, I have here a cup. This cup is full of 
smoke. Let me show you. What I'm about to do is swallow the smoke from the cup into my tummy as much as possible. And a little bit from here. My tummy is completely full of smoke. I have some liquid soap. Let me try it first to make sure it works okay. Lemon. Let's mix it together. I'm going to make a large bubble to begin. A little soap, a little water, mix it together, and we're going to make a bubble. So, now I have the smoke in here. Do you want me to let, let it out, or shall I put it in a bubble? Put it in a bubble. In a bubble. Okay. Now, do you want all the smoke in a bubble or half of it? Half of it. Half of it. I am going to make a bubble, bring up the smoke which is in my tummy, and I will put half of it into this bubble for you. Here is the smoke. The bubble, and the smoke is coming up. your smoke. So, hey, what about the other half? Shall I bring it up? It's coming up. Ah, uh, I have to take an egg. So, here's the deal. When the egg hits the bottom, the smoke will automatically return, and then the egg will come back afterwards. And it's a raw egg. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much indeed, everybody. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you.